Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. This is the Stepford map. Now, uh, last time around, I uh, got uh, all of the inputs to these uh, factories here uh, connect up. Steel should be coming up here eventually. So what I, what I need to do, um, really, is get the uh, final products out to some towns, right? Now, uh, here we can see New New York uh, demands goods. Uh, and so I can bring the goods from here into here. Now let's, uh, let's just uh, take a look here. Uh, we'll grab the freight drop off here so we can see. So we've got uh, goods demand over on this side here. Um, right, okay. Now, if we drop it off here, oh, that covers just about everything. Uh, yeah, we'll drop it off right there. Bam. Uh, okay, and uh, we're going to need a uh, truck station to pick up here. Uh, we only need one, yep, uh, platform. We'll make it the longest platform. Uh, now... Uh, we can go ahead and do this. Uh, this is the Cityville Goods Factory. So this is also going to be the Cityville Goods Factory. Right? Uh, okay. Uh, and it occurs to me I keep saying right all the time. Uh, that's got to be annoying, right? Yeah, see? There I went and did it again. Um, okay. So I need to get... I need to get up to here, and we've got some traffic congestion there to deal with. Okay. Well, uh, I think, yeah, bring it in, in along here, down here, and then back out this way, I think. So, uh, I guess, uh, let's see. That is a busy train line. I want to go over it, I think. Well, we'll keep this uh, on the level so we don't go down. Yeah. That's definitely not going to be enough to get a bridge. That might be. Nope. It's not. Okay. If we do this. That. That is enough to get a bridge. Come on. Where's straight? Oh, I shift on. Uh, oh, come on. Straight is over here. Okay. I think we only want to go up to about there. Now let's go for a... Uh, yeah, we'll go for that one. So we'll... That is steep. And then we'll go... Um, right. Now, we obviously can't, uh, get down that far, right? Um, but, we can get over the road. Yep. Ah, yes, okay. That will let us connect into here. Right? Yep. I think that's, uh... I think that'll work, yeah. Now, what we're going to need to do in here is uh, make sure we have uh, some lanes here where uh, uh, we won't be conflicting with... Uh, with other traffic, right? Uh, so that's, uh, that's, that's what that's all about. I just put, uh, you know, bus lanes on there. Right. Now, where is a, uh, oh, come on, we've got to have a, we, yeah, we do have a road station over here. Okay, now, we need to carry cargo, and it needs to carry goods, um, I think this one has been the uh, workhorse here that's done well. I'm going to put five of them on here. 
and uh, do a new line. It'll go here to here. Yeah, okay, that's tolerable. Um, right. Okay, that should work. So that's going to be cargo trucks from Cityville Goods Factory to Cityville, right? That is Cityville, right? No, that's New New York. Duh. Uh, right. Uh, so let's uh, let's fix that. New New York. Okay, good. Now, those trucks are going to take a minute to get out there. They are working their way out there, of course. Um, at some point, I should see if I can do something about this uh, traffic jam, but I, I'm not... I'm not having much luck figuring that out off camera, and I know there's going to be some of you that are like screaming, uh, you need to look at the uh, where the people are going, the problem. Take a look at this. Look at all the potential destinations. Okay? Now, there's no way in the game to click on a piece of road and see where the cars are going from that piece of road, as far as I can tell. And, uh, you know, without that, it's really hard to tell where I need to uh, uh, put the uh, transit lines to. Um, right, and it's also, uh, this map is absolutely brutal as far as putting train lines in. So, uh, getting tra intercity trains is, um, well, let's just say unlikely. Uh, is uh, if we go over to this corner here, you can see I've done a bunch of that, and you get this sort of thing here, right? This uh, is just nasty because we don't have proper elevated stations. Uh, and yes, I am aware of the mods that do purport to provide them. They are they are basically crashy messes, uh, as far as uh, my experience with them goes. I've tried. Uh, the underground stations, uh, and uh, if you don't get it right the first time, try and, it's impossible to modify. And uh, trying to modify crashes the game basically half the time, at least. And you just can't gauge how, how far down things are, and uh, that leads to some other issues. And I've tried some elevated station setups, and uh, they have similar issues. Uh, Basically, the problem is that the trains are out of scale to the uh, surroundings, so it's it's hard to uh, fit things in neatly, right, in a dense area. But uh, at some point, I should probably put, like, replace the intercity buses or trams or whatever they are with uh, some sort of a train network over here. But look at how close all of this stuff is, so... Uh, so this, this is a, if you ever want to make a really challenging map, just put a bunch of towns in really close together. Now I want to check something while I'm over here. Yeah, we got traffic lights on here. We don't want traffic lights on there. Um, we don't have any on there. Uh, yeah, we don't have any in the way there. That one doesn't want one. Yeah, typically having traffic lights in the wrong place just makes things not work. But here, I think it will work better with them. Uh, right. Uh, why do I think that'll work better? Because the traffic lights have a separate phase for uh, buses. Uh, and that can uh, definitely help. Uh, something else that would help over here. While I'm thinking about it, I'm just going to bang it in. To see if I can, at least. Is if I put a uh, bus lane along here. And probably along here. Uh, okay, do this. Bus lane. Bus lane. Uh, okay, 
So that means that the transit vehicles don't get stuck up with the private traffic, and that probably helps a little bit, but not nearly as much as you might hope. Now, I do have connections between towns and so on that aren't overloaded. So I've managed to get some of it sorted out. Anyway, uh, we haven't had any steel get here yet. Uh, now, let's take a look here. We have steel coming. Okay. Now let's uh, take a look at this line, rate 73. That's obviously too little. So uh, what I want to do... I want to extend these uh, these platforms just a little bit. Uh, okay, uh, configure. Uh, nope. One, two. That should take it up to 200 meters. Platform. Right? Uh, so now if I go back down to the steel mill over here, Yeah, uh, so I'll have a little bit of a challenge trying to extend the platform here. I'm going to have to do it on this side. Uh, but I need another platform, actually, is what I need here, because we've got all of these things coming in here. And I think I'm going to put a longer platform over here and then bend it around in. Uh, so, uh, we're going to go in here. Uh, we're going to configure this. Um, can't... Oh, I can get one back there. Okay. One, two, three. This is a 160 meter platform. What was it? So that's 200. We'll make it... We'll make it 240. Um, I can't... F ah, okay. I see. I'm going to have to rejig the uh, rails to do it that way. Um, okay, I won't extend it there. Uh, platforms. Eh. Well, I can make that work by uh, taking the viaduct out there. Okay. If I uh, do this... Uh tracks yes no catenary we go over here like that i'm pretty sure doing this will remove the uh, conflict okay uh platforms it does okay um you know what i'm gonna put one more on here uh, so that's going to need a track piece and then come in here um, yeah okay and we're gonna come in like this yeah like this right okay so I have to bring this out just a little bit further um, yeah, let's see. Uh, yeah, that's going to be a, just a little bit of a uh, issue there. Um, okay, but I can bring this up like that. Do that. And I can double slip that. Right. Okay. Now, uh, I'm going to need... Uh, one of these and I think I'm gonna need one of these and one of these that's close though now I'm gonna do that so I don't so it doesn't change tracks here uh, I can put a waypoint to solve that too but um, and then if I put one of those there then the exiting trains can do a little better right Okay, now, uh, terminals, the, uh, right, that one can go over to terminal three, uh, 
Right. Okay. So that's got the uh, got it on the longer platform there, and that's uh, one, two, three, four. That's a six uh, section platform. So if we go back over to Cityville, where is it? Over here. This is one, two, three, four, five. Okay, they're the same length now. Now I can make um, a longer train on there. Um, here, uh, manage, uh, edit, and those are. Uh, oh, I want cargo. Those are flat cars. They are uh, that one or that one. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that one. Okay. Okay, so that gets us three more cars on there. 10 cars. Yeah. Okay. So we'll do that. And I'm going to duplicate it. I'm going to put a second train on there. Now let's, uh, let's, uh, go in here and see. Now the rate, the rate is listed as 152. Now that's still, uh, low. So I might need a third train on there. I'm not sure. Uh, but, uh, that should get things uh, moving. Uh, right. Okay. So that, uh, that's that. Now we also need to get the, uh, the goods out of here, uh, into Metropolis. So, uh, that is going to require another drop off point and the goods are wanted up here. I see. So, Oh, and, and some of them are down there. So if I drop it off, uh, where? If I drop it off up here, I get most of it. Yeah, okay, well, I'll drop it off up there then. Okay. Now that's going to need a road to get into there. How am I going to get a road into there? That is a little bit of a question, isn't it? Well, I don't think that's as hard as it looks. No, I think it's harder than it looks. I want to avoid the uh, major traffic, right? So, I want to be coming up this way, and then over this way, and then back out again. Okay, well, if I uh, modify this and put an entrance over here, that'll make it slightly easier. Now, I need a road. Um, let's just grab the uh, country road thing. Uh, now, I just need to bang it out to here. And then we go in here and make that us only. Okay. Now we come in here and turn off the traffic light. Right? But it's just like that. So that'll let us get in there. Uh, now I'm going to want a uh, wider road coming up. Well, we'll put it there as well here and here all the way down here and over here yeah do that okay yeah that should be that should be good now let's do the uh, bus lane fandango here Okay, good. Uh, I'm going to want uh, waypoints on here, I think. Let's just see what path it takes. So we're going to buy uh, the same tarpaulin truck 
We'll put five of them again. And we're going to go a new line from here to here. And it does not go the way I want it to go, so I will be uh, chucking in some, uh, some waypoints. Uh, okay. Uh, but, uh, turn that off. This is the uh, Metropolis Goods to Metropolis. Yeah. Okay. Now, I need to go in roads and I need waypoints. So, I'm going to put a waypoint here. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I think that's the only waypoint I need. Uh, so we'll manage the line, add the waypoint. Yeah, okay. That moves it off of here, which is really busy. So, okay, that should mostly work. Good. Good. That should be getting, now here, we're limited by plastics, but we are producing goods. Okay. So far, so good. Now, uh, I think that's pretty much all we need to do there. Um... Yeah, I think it is. Um, this traffic has got to be through traffic. No, it doesn't. What? What? It's going... I think it's going from here to here. Yeah, we got a whole bunch of stuff coming into here. Now, is that... Due to uh, lack of transport connections. Oh no, it's coming through to here. Up to Winchesterton Fieldville. Yeah, that's what's happening. We do have a rail line from here into here. And then up into here, but it doesn't come up into New New York. And I think we need to get it up into Cityville. I think that might be why things are uh, basically uh, basically gridlocked. Um, I wonder, can I get? A train connection up through New New York into uh, Cityville. Well, I think I probably can. I do have a tram connection here. Let's take a look at that. Frequency four minutes. Oh, it's actually frequency. Uh, right. Well, that's... Yeah. I wonder if I can get this, uh... This line up here. Let's just uh, take a look in Cityville. Destinations. Uh... So they're going to Hawkins, Pork Belly... Fair number to Winchesterton Fieldville and points beyond, I think. All right, going to Pork Belly. Um, what have we got here? Star City. Yeah. There's a fair bit going to points beyond, so uh, 
I think I really do need to get a train connection up there. And but the only logical place I could split it off is probably Emerald City. Uh I think I'd need to come up through uh, Metropolis and New New York. Uh, I think... Uh, actually, no. I think it'd be a uh, line from... Yeah, what would I do? This is a freight delivery station, right? I could add passengers to that. Yeah, there's room for a passenger platform there. Then where would I bring the uh, tracks? Probably out and under. Over into Metropolis. Probably right about here. And then down into... Yeah. Huh. Huh. Not sure. That's a bit of a poser, isn't it? Uh, well, where would I? What would I do with the station here? I'd probably put it. Pro I'd probably put it right here. Yeah, I could put it there. Work my way out and into New New York. And from New New York, I could get down to Emerald City if I do things right. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to try that. So, uh, if I come in here and I uh, do this, uh, if I put a... Uh, ...120 meter, uh, we'll put a two high speed. Oh, for pity's sake, pause it. Uh, we go in here. If I put a two-track station, I can get a uh, building on both sides. But I want it to be like this. Yeah, I'm going to put level crossings in. Uh, okay. Wait, that's a terminus station. I can use a terminus station. I could put it here. Could put it here. Yeah, I'll put it there uh, just because. Uh, yeah, I'll put it on this side of the road. If I get over here, no, if I get over, over about there, yeah. Uh, and then if we uh, configure it, I can chuck a uh, whoop, passenger building over here, say. Yeah. Uh, and that gets uh, tendrils over to this road. Okay. Now, if I, co I come out of there, and then New New York, I'd want to be coming parallel this way. Okay. So I take that out. Pause it. Uh, train station. Through. Yeah. Uh, turn it around this way. And, uh, oh, this one I'll want to elevate. Uh, just because I don't want to conflict with my uh, surface stuff. Okay. So, I think that's high enough. That's too high. Oh, for pity's sake. I think that's high enough. So if I put that here, uh, like this, yeah, okay. Then configure it. Nope. Oh, come on. Go in here, configure it, take the uh, building out, uh, put the. What are these? Oh, uh, put this here um yeah i'll just put it on the one side here and then i put in the uh, uh the trick 
to get uh, to get passengers in like this. Now the trick to prevent weirdness is then just say you own the road. Okay, and now that has got catchment down to here and uh, here. So, and even here. Uh, actually, if I take this down to here as well, uh, yeah, that, uh, that probably reduces the travel time just a little bit. Okay. Then I need to get down to Uh, where was I going? Winchester and Fieldville. So I need to get over to Emerald City, uh, where there's an existing train line. Or I could, I could actually come down to Riverdale. Uh, I think I could connect up to Riverdale easier. Okay. Well, let's just try that and see if uh, if that gets rid of some of the traffic. Uh, okay. So. Uh, we come off of here like this. Uh, uh, how terrible is that? Eh. Let's do this. Um, okay, I think that's the... Uh, the angle we want. Okay. Good. Now, we come out of here uh, like this. We need to get across there. Um, yeah, that'll work. Uh, we'll take our concrete bridge. Bridge pillar. Why is there a bridge pillar collision there? Okay. Well, we're going to have to clear our path first. That's probably why. Okay, so we'll clear that stuff out. Now let's try that again, huh? Okay, over to here. Uh, do this. Do this. And this. And then this. That is not a bridge pillar collision. Okay. And like that. Okay, that gets us out. And then uh, where do we need to aim? We need to aim that way. Okay. Okay, we'll come off of here. Uh, we need to come this way. Now, if we do this, uh, we've got a we've got a uh, level crossing there. That's not going to do. Okay, but we can get there. What? Okay, uh, where, there it is. We need to get up and over this. Come on, really? We can't from there, huh? Okay. Let's see. Let's see what we can do here. Um, yeah, I need to go up one more, I think. Nope. Well, that one would get over. That's higher than it needs to be, though. Okay. Maybe it's not. Okay. Okay, no. That one works. Okay. So, 
Yeah, okay, I'll try that with this. Good. Now, can I get this to work? Oh, that will. Okay. Too much slope. But not with the bridge. With that, it's too much slope. Why? Okay. Uh bridge go okay too much slope what okay well i guess i'm gonna have to bring it off further back okay well that's uh that we can do if i think if i bring it off over here like this. Uh, do this. Do this. This. Yeah, okay. We'll try that. Now, if I uh, bring this around like this and do this, that doesn't complain. Okay. Good. That gets us over there. Good. Um... And then I should be able to just wang this around here. Yeah, the viaduct is fine. Uh, okay. Good. That gets us a connection in there. Uh, I should put the uh, signal back, uh, don't you think? Uh, so we'll need a signal. And a signal. And a signal. Yeah? Yeah, that should be about right. Okay. Let's uh, let the uh, traffic move again. Now, we need to come down from here. Uh, and we need to get in... Okay, this is going to have to... Okay. This is going to be another pause job. Uh, right. Yeah, this is running a bit long, but I want to see... Um, I want to see how uh, uh, how well this doesn't work. Okay, if we do this, no. What if we do this? Bridge pillar collision with what? Okay. Come around like that. Now, will this go? It does. Good. Okay. And we can come out like this. Come on. Okay. We can level that. Good. Um, right. Now... I need to, what do I need? I need to get over this road, and then I can drop down to ground level, I think. Yeah, that's tolerable. Okay, good. Now, I just need to route this out, and this could be entertaining. Okay, let's, uh, you know what, let's take that out, yeah, uh, because I'm going to need, uh, an X here, uh, okay, let's do this, uh, do this, yeah, there we go, uh, and then I just need to get it out. So, like this. Yeah, these are sharp corners. That's fine here. Uh, I'm not aiming for the fastest train ever. I'm aiming for a train. Um, 
Yeah, that didn't uh, that didn't go well, did it? Uh, okay, take that out. Try that again. Uh, okay. Nope. Track. Do this. Okay. Now, what you can do is you can grab a road that's straight, whack it back in. Problem solved. Uh, you think so, do you? Well, I can whack one of these in, too. Yeah, we'll do that. Just to confuse the issue. Now, uh, right, I need to put the rest of the rail in. So this, I should be able to just wang it onto here. And what do you know? It doesn't give too much slope. Okay, so we'll do that. Uh, right, so we come from here to here. Okay, now, what do I need? I need one of these. Uh, a building, this thing, bang it on there. Good. Uh, right. I, sh I should be able to see how this is uh, going with uh, a single train. Uh, we'll go with an electric multi-unit. We'll take the metro liner. We'll add one. And a uh, new line, which goes from here to here to here and back. Yep. Okay. Uh, and that's going to be the... Uh, Cityville, uh, Riverdale, uh, Intercity. Yeah, okay. Now, uh, what I should, I should have done is uh, put these in. Uh, okay, so I'm going to need one of those. And I think over here and over here. And uh, over here, and lots of signals because I may end up putting lots of trains on here. Uh, probably won't, but I might. Uh, it's just a uh, a thing, right? Uh, these aren't necessarily going to be super fast trains, but they will move. Uh, people around and I'm hoping this manages to take some of the uh, load off of the uh, um, okay manage line yeah that looks okay um, okay now let's just uh, Let's just jump on board here and uh, and see what it looks like. Uh, is what we're going to do is we're just going to check this out. And uh, this is going to obviously be the end of the part if you've been looking at the length of it. Uh, but this is kind of what I've been doing to try and get a handle on the intercity traffic. And uh, hopefully uh, putting a train line here uh, will get a whole bunch of the through traffic out to Cityville. Uh, removed uh, is if we can do that I think that's a large chunk of what's backing up the roads uh, even into Winchesterton Fieldville is by putting this connection in we actually get a connection through to Winchesterton Fieldville that doesn't require uh, uh, a vehicle connection Which is the point of this, right? Yeah, so if I could uh, find some uh, elevated stations that I'm actually happy with, uh, I could redo some of this and it would look better. But this concrete bridge, uh, the, it's a stock bridge, as I recall, is a pretty solid one for building viaducts, actually.
But yeah, this is more like a uh, metro connection rather than a uh, intercity uh, train line, uh, which uh, which is why I wasn't concerned about the speed being like under a hundred k, or these intersections like this one here. Actually, that turned out okay. I probably should put a second platform over here. Probably. There's room for a second platform, at least. Uh, first train is taking 23 from uh, the end of the line, so that's promising, actually. Yeah, I think I should put a second uh, platform in there. And maybe I'll end up having to quad track it through here. Uh, just because, uh, you know, it's, it's going to make uh, things busy, right? Uh, but I'm going to leave things as they are for the moment. It was a quick and dirty proof of concept, really. And just to show you what I've been doing uh, off camera and the other parts of the uh, the Metroplex over here. Um, Megalopolis, whatever you want to call it. There's some great words for uh, uh, large urban areas that are all run together. You know, Megalopolis, conurbation, uh agglomeration, things like that. Actually, these uh, el these elevated lines, uh, you know, they look kind of uh, kind of nice. Well, we got some passengers picking up on there and on here, so I think we're going to need at least two trains in here. Yeah, I might have to quad track it down at the uh, the other end there, just to avoid uh, traffic jams. Um, yeah. Uh, I, I, either way, uh, this is uh, this looks like it's uh, working out okay. It'll take a while, if this actually helps, it'll take a while for the traffic on the highways to uh, drop off. Uh, just because, uh, you know, once it's already on the road, it doesn't despawn unless, it, I think, its destination or its uh, source point disappear. Uh, I'm not sure exactly. But I think if its source point, like, like the home, disappears, I think the traffic despawns. I think this is probably a bit longer tunnel than it needs to be, but you know what? It's fine. And we come in here. Bit roller coastery, I think. But it should be fine. Uh, creeping in here a little bit slow is fine. Uh, good. And we got a big stack of passengers waiting here. Well, a medium stack. Well, a group. Yeah, I guess you don't actually stack passengers, do you? Okay, so let's see how many we pick up here. More than half a load, so uh, that's uh, that's pretty decent. Um, that may be reducing traffic already, actually. Uh, while I'm here, I'm just going to take a look. We don't want traffic lights here or here. Yeah. And over here, we don't want them there or there or there. 
Yeah. Okay, that definitely wasn't helping, but that wasn't the uh, big problem either. But I think we'll see that as this uh, line of traffic uh, either despawns or, or makes progress, uh, the rest of this traffic will probably start going down now. And that's simply because we have a rail connection that uh, allows the, uh, the people to uh, get somewhere. But now the town's growing. So, uh, you know, I could, by putting, putting that in, we probably increased this quite a bit. Uh, but destinations, uh, now let's look at line usage here. Um, why is it, why is it doing that? Um, you get over here. Uh, you can't resize these. Um, okay. Well, anyway, uh, that's going to get uh, more uh, transport usage anyway. Um, Yeah, I think this is uh, this part. This part here is currently what's backing it up, uh, and I think that is going down. And it's because it's all gridlocked over here, right? So ultimately, uh, if we can, we can uh, eventually get this traffic here to clear. I like, see you got traffic despawning there, uh, but if the traffic can clear. Uh, enough that this bit clears, uh, we, we might make some progress. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this time because, uh, well, quite frankly, we've done enough monkeying around. Uh, and uh, off camera, I'll probably try and balance things a little bit more, uh, maybe run it a bit to see if this, uh, this uh, clears up a bit. Uh, hopefully it does but I can't be completely sure. Uh, either way, this line we just put in looks like it will be profitable. So uh, I guess that's, uh, that's a bonus there. Uh, could probably do another one that comes up through, that peels off here, comes through Metropolis, Emerald City, and uh, maybe into Gotham or... Oh, yeah, I could come off here, Metropolis, come through Emerald City, and then peel off toward Gotham or something like that. Uh, Gotham doesn't have any onward connections, though. It's, uh, it's a stub. Um, so, um, it does have a tram connection into it. A couple of them. Well, actually... Uh, let's, uh, put more of those on there. That might help a little bit. Anyway, that's going to be all for this time. So, I guess, uh, stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And see you back next time.